All right, due to a mishap, I still don't have any of my English Twilight Masquerade stuff that I ordered. I don't know how it happened. I don't know why it happened. I am uh, just kind of in a bind here because the stuff is still coming. It's just heavily delayed. And because of that, I am only left with some Japanese packs of Mask of Change. And it's really upsetting because I thought by now I would have had my English product in, but apparently not. And it's not the end of the world. I'm not really here to be like directly on top of a new set when it comes out. But it would have been nice to open it within like a certain time of it coming. Whatever. Anyway, in today's video, we are opening 10 packs of the Japanese Twilight Masquerade set. Again, Mask of Change. We opened this last time. We got a good couple cards. Let's see what we can get again this time. Again, um, I'm not sure how long the video is going to be. I'm going to try to keep it under 10 minutes realistically under five would be even better i don't know a card trick again i'm not gonna do one i think it's two to the front that could be wrong let's try it anyway let's see two to the front we got the masks oh and please like and subscribe because i really appreciate it we got clefable we have got phantom uh conkledor conkledor no, Gerder, Gerder. And a Seeking with no Hollow or Ultra Rare. That is fine. Pack number one, dud. So anyway, I ordered some Twilight Masquerade. I ordered a booster box and an ETB. They're still not here. I don't know why. Um, Amazon said they were supposed to be here like two weeks ago. And then the seller messaged me. Or they messaged me like there was some kind of like issue. Uh, they'll be here. I just don't know when. Hopefully soon. We have Grookey. Sorry. Swirlix. I don't want to put these down like the wrong spot on my table. Later on. Okay, so it's... It's it's one to the front. Okay. And Luxray EX. Very cool. Okay. We have got a Luxray EX as our first pull of the box. Or of the packs, really. It's only ten of them. And um, we are two packs in. Which is pretty cool. I wonder if we're going to get an SIR in this one. We also haven't pulled any art rare from what I remember. Or maybe we pulled one. I'm not sure. But either way, I would like to see more art rares. Perhaps an SIR in Japanese. That would be kind of cool. Going into pack number three. It is one to the front. Correct. We have got Glalie. The Sandcastle. Ducklet. The Ladybug. And Carmine. Nothing in that one. Okay, that's uh, three packs in, and we've only got one hit. Fine, fine. I don't expect every pack to be a winner. Pack number four. I'm going to have to pause this in a second, by the way. My dog just went in the other room, and she usually only goes in there. She's trying to bark at somebody. Venipede and Glamora. Okay. Fourth pack, fourth pack. We're halfway through. This is pack number five we'll be opening here. Um, this is, um, in my honest opinion, not a great set. There's not a lot that I am personally interested in pulling in this set. And I feel like a lot of people share this with me. But um, uh, but then again, I try not to take a lot of what the Pokemon community says when it comes to these sets. Because I feel like everyone calls every set mediocre now. It doesn't matter what actually... Oh, Polygraph, pretty cool. It doesn't actually matter what's in the set anymore. Um, as I feel like most people will complain if it doesn't have Eeveelutions, particularly Umbreon now, because that's the one everybody wants, or Charizard. And it, uh, it's uh, not a good look for people who claim to be Pokemon card collectors. It's really... It just makes you look dumb. Anyway. We've got the bird. Poliwhirl. The bulb. And it's a really cool picture of Heatran. I'll definitely say that. We got four packs left. That was pack number five. Four packs left. This is actually not going so great. But again, there's not a ton I wanted to pull in this set. So opening only a little bit of it is fine for me. It was the same thing with Temporal Forces. Um... Okay, okay, what do we got here? Layron? Layron. Very nice. Okay. 
that is our art rare um yeah i'm not i'm not super interested in anything in particular in this set except for the sirs for my sir binder but i think i'm gonna wait until those go down in price three packs left by the way i'm gonna wait till those go down in price because i don't feel like a lot of them are very playable or if they are i feel like they will get quinkly stomped by whatever comes out in the next set i feel like that happens a lot in pokemon now but regardless Again, I just think that this is not a, this is a very middle of the line set. Nothing special here. And hopefully the next one will be cool. All right, we've got the big sand castle. The sun man. And is that a swana? Swana. Very nice. We've only got one pack left. And we've only gotten three hits if you want to count the heatran as a hit. So this will be a last pack. Can we get some last pack magic? Let's find out. That was a pretty big rip right there. Wow. Okay, what do we got here? The net that's uh, electrified, I guess. Uh, the T. Snow Run. Far-fetched. Wow, and that's really what we're going to end on, Melodic. Okay, so all in all, out of these 10 packs, we pulled... Luxray EX, Lairon Art Rare, and a Heatran Hollow. And that's it. That's everything we got here. And you know something? That's fine. Um, we're going to cut the video here. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe. It really helps me out. And I'm going to catch you guys in the next video. And hopefully, by the time this comes out, I will have my English stuff in. And I can make some videos for it. It's for you guys as well. With that... I'll see you. Peace out.